Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Mohammad Essen and today we're going to talk about Comdirect and how you can open an account with them. Before we continue, I would really appreciate if you hit the like button and if you like my content, uh, please subscribe and share it with your friends. So Comdirect is another brokerage account similar to Trade Republic. If you have not watched my Trade Republic video, I would be linking that in the description below. Before showing you how you can open an account, I would like to go uh, in the fee structure for Comdirect. It's free to open an account with Comdirect for the first three years. And after the first three years, it remains free for certain conditions. For example, if you perform two trades per quarter with them, or have a current account with Comdirect or if you have at least one savings plan with them which is executed once per quarter otherwise it's going to be one euro 95 cents per month so let's talk about costs of buying and selling stocks and ETFs with Comdirect Comdirect you pay three euro 90 cents per transaction per transaction I mean each time you buy or sell stocks for example if you buy one stock of apple for 100 euros then 3 euros 90 cents would be added on top of that as a fee so you'll be paying 103 euros 90 cents for buying one stock of apple however if you buy 10 stocks it will again remain 3 euros 90 cents so after 12 months it's going to cost you 4 euro 90 cents per transaction and in addition, there will be 0.25% of your order volume. But if you are a frequent trader, which means you perform more than uh, 125 in two quarters per year, this will reduce the cost to 15%. Uh, within this, the minimum fee uh, becomes 9 euro 90 cents and the maximum fee becomes 59 euros 90 cents let's have the apple example again so you had your account with comdirect for more than a year now you're in the second year or let's say any other year then apart from the first one now you buy uh, you buy a single apple stock again now instead of 103 euros 90 cents it's going to cost you 9 euro 90 cents as the minimum fee uh, per transaction is 9 euro 90 cents if you buy a large number of stocks it's not going to cost you more than 59 euros 90 cents in terms of fees from comdirect for savings plans comdirect costs 1.5 percent of your order volume per transaction in addition to the total expense ratio of the etf that you're buying for example if you buy an etf that costs 100 euros you'll be paying 1.5 euros transaction fee in addition to the total expense ratio which varies etf to etf you can open a comdirect account in three steps the first one is to fill out an online application the second one is to verify your account um, for comdirect you'll have to verify using post ident and the third and final step would be to assign a pin to your ibn account download the photo 10 app and activate it and then start using your comdirect account if you would like to go in the details for the costs associated with a comdirect depot account i will be attaching a link in the description which has all the costs associated with buying and selling stocks and etfs with comdirect to open an account with comdirect you can go to comdirect.de click depot then Comdirect Depot and click Yes Depot I open it. Uh, you have to be careful that sometimes people get confused with opening a depot account or a brokerage account with a current account. Uh, Comdirect also offers a current account which you can open uh, along with your deposit account or your brokerage account. But in this example, I'm only going to show you how you can open your brokerage account with Comdirect. So once you're on this page, you can click Yes Depot a Opening. Then you have to fill in your details. I will be filling out my details here. First name, 
last name, date of birth, place of birth, and then country of birth. So for Pakistan, it says that in order to verify the identity, I will have to go to a Deutsche Post post office or a, a Deutsche Post to verify using the post ident. So we click Viter. Here we provide our address. Then once we fill out our address, we provide our email address. After that, your phone number and then click writer. Here you'll have to fill in your job description. There are many options available and you can click any one which is suiting for you. For me, it's understood. Which branch? Uh, so I'm belonging to um, if you're not sure about which which branch you're belonging to just click Kanyan Gabe and then click Viter. here it's better to provide your tax ID number it's optional at this moment but later on it will be very beneficial for you to provide your tax ID so that your tax information is automatically submitted to the finance arm or the financial office you don't have to fill in your financial information manually so are you uh, here you'll have to select are you paying taxes elsewhere uh, in most cases no most people are paying this taxes in germany so click nine and click writer here Comdirect needs to know how much experience do we have with stocks, ETFs, mutual funds and bonds. You can view the complete document details once you click here. In our case, we would be selecting no as we don't have that much experience. Then click Viter. Uh, then we have to select our reference account from which we are going to send money into our deposit account once you fill your IBN number click on Gabe Uberbuffen check your check your details if they are provided correctly then click Viter it is recommended that you read the documents about the contract and make sure that you you give them consent to record your phone calls provide you with emails and or they can con contact you with telephone stuff like that and then you can click on track send in then you'll receive an email from them which will have your contract have a look at that contract fill it out if anything is missing make sure to sign it because that's really important and then print it out for pakistani nationals and many other nationalities they will have to print out the form and bring it to the post office along with their passport there they can do there they can do the identification process using post ident if you're not required to go in person for your identification process in my trade republic video i have shown how you can do it with the web id how you can do your video identification it's similar to post direct uh, and the experience should be similar apart from uh, how the web interface is when i opened my account with comdirect i had to go in person in order to submit my contract i went to the post office and submitted my contract but there was a problem that their device was not reading my passport clearly uh, one of the persons who was there scanned my passport and said they are not able to read my signature uh, i insisted a little bit and then 
they tried once more but the device was not able to read the, my signature in the passport they said they can do nothing about that and I, I should contact Comdirect personally and see if there's a solution to that I tried to contact Comdirect but they said that's the only way and I should go again to the post office and insist that they should do it again I went to the post office after a few days there was another person uh, they tried also to scan my document and it did not uh, read my signature so I insisted and they tried a couple of times and after fifth or sixth time they were able to verify my signature and sent my contact to Comdirect. It took eight weeks for my account to open. The opening time varies because of the pandemic situation. It can be from four to six weeks but in my case it was eight weeks. If you like the video please don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe and share it with your friends. If you have any questions please write them down in the description and I'll try to answer them as soon as possible. Until the next video, bleib gesund.